students today we are going to learn about the exercise of on matrices we are proceeding mcq number 90 the topic on the matrices some mcqs are taken very important for the previous paper in also let's come we start question number 90 The number of solutions. The number of solutions of the equation. Two x plus three y is equal to eight. Number first one. Number second two. And number third two or more. And a is equal to nine of these. Look here. Here the system has given one equation: two x plus three y is equal to eight, and the unknown variables are used here too. They are given that one equation, one equation, number of number of equations. Equation is one. Number of Unknown variables in this equation is two. So number of equation is number of equations. Equation is less than number of variables. Number of unknown variables. That is one is less than two, so that will be for any number of equation the minimum the minimum number of solution of the equation the minimum minimum number of solution is required for this two or more any system of required is that one if the number of equation is less than the number of one. The minimum number of minimum number of minimum number of solutions of the equation two x plus three y is y right solution. And the n y right solution number c. Unique solution and D does not exist. So the number of equation is number of equations. Number of equation is one, and number of unknown variables are used in this equation. Is two, so number of equation is less than one. So in this case, so we have infinite solution. The matrices, the matrices A is equal to A I J is equal to two plus three, and B is equal to B I J. Is equal to three cross four. Then the matrices are suitable for what? For addition, subtraction, 
and multiply as one more. Multiplication and the none of these. So look here. In case of multiplication, yeah, P value is repeated. If A is M cross N and B is equal to N cross P. So in this situation, both must be same. This is our. In case of here, two cross or two cross two by P and three by four are given there. So this will be our same. So in this situation, so multiplication is applicable for the matrices or any matrices if this value are same. So uh, column has column are same to the rows. So in this situation, multiplication are conformable for the given matrices. If a is equal to identity then A inverse is equal to what is the answer? A is equal to A and B is equal to A inverse and C is equal to A and B and D is equal to none of these. In this situation A inverse is equal to A is given there so A inverse is required A inverse according to this property A A inverse and A and once A is equal to identity, in this situation we can say that A is the inverse of A or inverse of A is equal to A. The conjugate of A is equal to 3, 1 minus I will have 2 plus 3 iota and 8. The conjugate of A is equal to A is equal to first answer we get minus 3 1 plus iota 2 plus 3 iota and minus 8 B is equal to 3 1 plus iota and 2 minus 3 iota and 8 and C is equal to minus 3 1 plus iota 2 minus 3 iota and minus 8 and D is equal to 3 8 and 3 8 and 3 and 1 to mark plus iota and minus 2 plus 3 iota so in this situation conjugate is required conjugate we change here the immediate part the sign of the immediate part here this sign will be changing change into plus so here this answer is correct b is the correct answer if we take the conjugate of this one we have get the sign is 1 plus iota similarly we change here 2 plus 3 iota so the answer is 2 minus 3 iota so the correct answer will be B is the correct answer. If A is any skew symmetric matrix, skew symmetric symmetric matrix of of odd order, then a determinant is equal to what is the answer? A is equal to 1, D is equal to 0, and C is equal to 2, and D is equal to 1 by 2. So, skew symmetric matrix, skew symmetric matrix according to the definition of an air, skew symmetric matrix if we are applying in an air, or skew symmetric matrix A transpose is equal to minus A. But here an odd order of each determinant is equal to zero. In this situation, odd order, so the result will be equal to zero. The determinant of
z zero 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 z zero 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 and z. What is the answer in here? A is equal to zero, B is equal to one, C is equal to z, and D is equal to z cube. If we take here any other values are upper diagonal and lower diagonal, both are zero and half. So in this situation, we can say that we take the main principal diagonal. This is a triangular matrix and triangular upper and lower triangular matrix. So in case of we take the determinant of a main principal main principal diagonal principal diagonal product of main principal diagonals we take the product of main principal diagonal elements and here if we take every terminal for example z and z and z so we can z q is the correct answer correct answer is g is the correct answer in this situation 99 for any square metric f a p is equal to zero then a is called Then put it metric I then put it metric and word able and word able metric square metric. Look here, this is the definition of A, B is called nail potent, nail potent. So the correct answer is that one A, B is equal to zero, then A is called nail potent. Nail potent metric. So if you change here the question, 100. Number question and here we change here so that will be a square is equal to a so then a is called in this situation a square is equal to a then a is called by then put it so the correct answer will be equal to a hundred in case of a square is equal to A, so and this will be I dare put a metric. This is the definition of I dare put a metric A by A. Yeah, means that A square is equal to 1 for any square metric, and here A square is equal to identity metric, and here, and this will be, and if you change here, and voluntary metric. And relatory metric. So L in relatory metric. And this is this is the definition of in relatory metric. So correct answer will be here in relatory metric. In case of a square metric, if A square is equal to identity metric, then A is called in relatory metric. 102 for e square metric and a transpose is equal to a as is equal to identity or a transpose is equal to a so then the metric then the metric is called metric is called neatly metric Unitary metric and be orthogonal, orthogonal metric.
metric and C is equal to I tempotent metric and D is equal to square metric. Look here, this is the definition of if A, 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 suppose is equal to I D D and once again if we change here the places so both are same so both are orthogonal metric in this situation orthogonal metric they are perpendicular we can also say that so in case of the vector if they are perpendicular to each other but they are subscribed by each other